Yo, what's up? This is Byron with Up in the House Records TV, chilling with Byron and Notorious Byron on YouTube. Uh, I wanted to talk about this situation. Uh, it's this YouTuber lady. She's a smaller YouTuber. Her name is uh, Stacy Little. And uh, she has a nephew, and I guess when Truthfully Trisha's uh, was, uh, I guess, being her normal self, being herself, uh, her nephew ran across Truthfully Trisha's, uh, one of Truthfully Trisha's videos or streams, and she was doing something inappropriate or something that she doesn't have them, no business doing on YouTube. So this Stacy girl, Stacy little girl, she was telling truthfully Trisha to uh, age restrict her videos because, you know, truthfully Trisha go live and everything like that. And she does a lot of things you know, that's, that kids should not see at all. And, uh, and truthfully, Trisha has a lot of, uh, followers that are kids, you know? So, uh, so she sent her, instead of responding to her in the right way, this black lady, uh, Stacy, uh, little, she sent her a video of a, of a black woman getting beat up. Okay, it asks you how low can truthfully shit should go. You know what I'm saying? Sending a video to a, a African American black woman of a another black woman getting beat up. How low can you go, truthfully Trisha? How low can you go? And so this lady has made a petition to get Truthfully Trisha off the internet and everything like that. Uh, I'm going to play a little bit of her video because I want y'all to hear, you know, this lady and stuff like that. So let's go. This is under fair use. Please subscribe to her channel. Uh, I give her credit for the, her video and everything like that. Please subscribe to this lady channel. She has, uh, I think, 224 uh, subscribers. Please just get her up, you know, up there. But anyways, uh, let's uh, watch this video. And yeah. Hold on, I can't even hear it, you guys. I'm going to have to take it off of uh, Disturb. Hmm. Hey, guys, I'm back. I'm going to try to make this real quick because my mic just may go out. Truthfully, Trish kicked off YouTube. This lady is currently basically exposing her body parts to young kids on YouTube. Oh, that's not good at all. It's kind of harder. Yeah. I can't really hear. Yeah. I guess the video kind of cut out and stuff like that. And keep in mind, you guys, there's people in the comment section, pretty much, they're going to uh, sign a petition and everything. A petition to get Truthfully Trisha offline. And of course, people might say, well, why do you want to get somebody offline? 
simply because if they're exposing their body parts to children, then, you know, of course you don't want that type of stuff online, do you? Especially on YouTube, right? That's not for YouTube. That's not YouTube appropriate. You know, I can see uh, if she was age restricting her videos and she was telling people, you know, like she was, you know, leaving disclaimers and telling people that this is for mature audience. And, uh, but exposing her body to little children that's you know that's not good that is so freaking sick and it makes me want to throw up so tell me tell me what y'all think do y'all think this petition that this lady is going to sign is it you know something that will help get truthfully trisha off the internet or maybe it will help her slow down a little bit to what she's doing. Because she sent, sent the video uh, to this lady, uh, Stacy uh, um, Little, um, of another black woman getting beat up. You know what I'm saying? And that's not cool at all. How low can you go, Truth Trisha? Tell me what y'all guys think. You know... Are y'all guys going to sign a petition to get Truth Letitia off the internet? Uh, I can't really say if I'm going to sign a petition, but I can say that I support this one woman straight up, you know, because that's not right. She, because her, uh, her nephew saw, you know, you know, like, Truthfully, Trisha's video when she was, you know, being nasty and stuff like that. But uh, tell me, get y'all guys what y'all think. And till then, peace out and God bless y'all. I hope y'all guys have a good, wonderful uh, Saturday. Remember, this is under fair use and everything. This is for commentary purposes only. And let me. Let me let y'all look at something else, okay? Hey guys, um, it's been brought to my attention and many of you guys that there's this girl on YouTube called Truthfully Trisha. She is a sexual pedophile. She's a, a whore, and she exposed all her genitalia to young kids here on YouTube. But That's I sick. By YouTube, that if I can get fifteen hundred names, that permanently off YouTube. So if you guys want to help me, I need you guys to subscribe to this channel, or if you don't really have to subscribe, just leave your name. Let's see, you know, see, if she got any link. She's no good about it. I'm joined up not just me, but a whole lot of other top YouTubers. We need fifteen hundred names. I already got seven hundred fifty of them alone. So, but I am going to do my part as a information system security officer for Homeland Security because not only have everybody's been affected, but I too have been affected by her because my nephew was on my YouTube page and she exposed her genitalia to him about four months ago. But me, you know, I didn't wait for YouTube. I personally told her what the hell I felt. And that's why every time I go on her channel, she was like, oh my God, sorry, Major. You know, this one of them has got three people committed suicide because of her bullshit. Oh, wow. Anyway, Which I already knew that, that, you know, but, but week, I'm like, wow. This particular, this particular uh, web, uh, live stream. Yeah, I'm not going to play our whole video because I, you know, I was just letting y'all know for those that didn't know what was going on. Yeah, it's just crazy, you know, guys, you know. I used to keep in mind, you guys, uh, about a year ago, I used to be friends with Truthfully Cheshire. And plus, I was her moderator before, and when I have a, had a different opinion, she unmodded me, which it's all gravy because, because we all know how she really is. Plus, it took me a year to find out, you know, how, what kind of person she was. So, yeah, uh, I will talk to you guys later. Peace out. Have a good day. Bye.